All right, everybody. This is episode 130, 130 for Dragon Ball Super. I got the timer down there in the bottom corner. And we're going to press play on the count of... I count down from three, so three, two, one, then I'll click play. Oh, the real fight starts now. Goku's confident. He looks hurt. How will he fight against a full power Jiren? What sort of conclusion will their fight have? He looks so cool. He's so super serious right now too, holy cow. Jeez. A little bit of blood going there, wow! I don't know about that, man. So he's just... dodging like nothing. Jeez. Holy crap, dude. Goku's a beast right now. Oh my god. <laughs> Look at that. He's totally against the ropes right now, like, not even kidding. Oh my god. Yeah, he's like, effortlessly dodging him. Man, the art is really good in this one too, holy cow. Jiren is totally on the defense. Like, he can't... He, like, can't do anything. Oh, man. Just completely annihilating him right now. Yeah, it's like completely one-sided. Goodness. Okay, now he's gonna go, what, full power now? Here's his... Oh yeah, he looks scuffed. Totally winded too. Belmont's probably freaking out right now. I don't know. Okay, so 
This entire time, he still wasn't full power. And now he is. It's kind of like when Freeze has said he was going to his final form, so you thought max power, but it wasn't. That it appears to be what's going on here. There goes the freaking rest of the ring. That transformation was actually pretty freaking epic, com you know, compared to the galaxy part. It was more explosive, at least. Ooh, he's got like a kind of Ultra Instinct sort of glow. Ooh, he looks like a badass. Yeah, he's feeding off that power. He's like a Super Saiyan 2 kind of thing. Yeah, he totally looks like he's got his Ultra Instinct power going. They're probably... Very much probably on par now. Maybe not. Goku still looks like he's got him. Come on, Goku. Does Goku escape? Does he instant transmission? Or is he gonna pull like a trunks and come out walking with it? Oh man, commercial already. That'd be so cool if he comes out holding that thing. They're not even going to show how he dodged it. Oh, uh, there's a tiny little pad they're standing on. Good grief, man. He's getting wrecked. You gonna lose it? No way. The problem is, 
he's already like at that spot. Like when he's always come back, that's at the spot he's at right now. He, this is the part where he's already come back. This is the Goku from back then. The guy that was willing to sacrifice his own life to save everyone. It's like, not quite like a Zenkai boost, but it's something kind of like that. That's pretty much been his entire, his entire thing. And it'll be the difference between winning and losing. Get him. Get him, Goku. Goodness, he's still getting... Oh, he did one of those, like, jet punch things. He knocked him like kind of down. He's not powered up anymore. Kind of sounded like a bad guy. Did he just fire his beam at them? music right now. Beat his ass. Look at that art. Oh my goodness. Dude. 
Get him! Knock his ass out of that ring, dude. Oh, you knocked him onto a freaking platform. Well, he's definitely powered down now. Look how shriveled he is. Don't let up. Beat his ass, dude. gonna do gonna give him energy what a doofus It's like when Kaioken ran out the first time he used it. Yep. Goku got ringed out. Oh! Oh, ho, ho, ho. it didn't get ringed out. Frieza saved his ass. Oh, Android 17 didn't die. It's still three on one now. And Jiren's maxed. Oh, ho, ho, ho. the end of the episode. It's a totally maxed out Jiren versus 17 and Frieza. Goodness. I thought they were ending Dragon Ball Super in like a handful of episodes. So that was pretty exciting. And it turns out the spoiler that I heard was not quite accurate. I bet it was a Japanese spoiler that got uh, translation like made it not come out right in English. So thanks for watching you guys, I'll see you next time.